Cosmic Huskies is back again with another Pokemon Worst to Best Rankings and today will be the Prism Supporters from the Sun and Moon series. I only have three but I'll show one of them in the book which I haven't got. So these are the four support cards from the Sun and Moon era Prisms that have been rotated out. And of course we have less Ultra Beasts now these days. And I need more commenters and more viewers because I might be setting up the community soon just to let you know what's going to happen and ask me in the comments what you think I should be doing soon. So anyway, I will be getting into this video. So the worst supporter prison card is Cyrus, also the leader of Team Galactic. Oh, it's just a motorbike there because it says you can't play this card if you don't have any water or metal Pokemon in play. Your opponent chooses two bunch of Pokemon and shuffles the other there's and all cards attach them into their deck. So this allows you to use only one Prism Supporter in every deck. And they uh, go into the Lost Zone, which Lost Zones were quite popular and not until they got rotated out. So this kind of lets you put one of your opponent's Pokemon into their bent decks, of course. So that is why it's the worst. In at number three, we have Lysander. And of course, we are getting Lysander will be coming back soon like the boss's orders to your mind because this one says for each of your five pokemon in play put a card from your opponent's discard pile into the lost zone so this kind of lets you put every discard pile in your opponent's discard part yours or opponent's discard pile to see which cards can go into the lost zone so you can decide which one it is. And of course we had Heat Factory Prism which was played a lot and now it's not. Due to the fact that we don't have Prisms except Tapu Koko and Shaman Prism. Those two will still be playing. So that is why Lysander's at number three. And this one was from Forbidden Light and the other one was from Ultra Prism. Now the... Second best Prism Supporter card would, would be Lance. Now Lance was a good supporter to play in a Dragon deck because it says you can play this card only if one of your Pokemon was knocked out during your opponent's last turn. Search your deck for up to two Dragon Pokemon and put them into your hand, then, sorry, then shuffle your deck. So like this was pretty much played a bit depending who's playing Dragon and of course Dragon and Fairy aren't going to be popular. They'll only be in Expanded because now we they are changed it to Psychic and Colourless type Pokemon now. Like they did in the uh, old generations. And of course Lance is the champion in Elite Four for all Pokemon game fans. So of course we got Rosa which is still going to be played a lot. In some decks before she gets rotated out. So that is why some people might play this in Expanded. So that's why he's at number two. To be fair. Num the best supporter at number one is Lusamine Prism. Now this support I got from a pre-release. And then another one from a pack. Because it says you can play this card only if one of your opponents has exactly three prize cards remaining. And it. Prevents all damage done to your Ultra Beast by attacks during your opponent's next turn. So this supporter lets you prevent damage from your opponent's attacks to your Ultra Beast. The Ultra Beast can do less damage from protection from other Pokemon. And of course, Ultra Beasts are less played now. And of course, Lusamine is quite popular to play an expanded and I done a video on the worst to best Aether Paradise cards if you want to check that out if you want to so there you go and of course we have the supporter Lysia Lysia 
that lets you search a deck for up to two prison cards, reveal them, put them into your hand, then shuffle your deck. So maybe you might play this and expand it. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like and a comment down below and make sure it's nice. And stay tuned next time. Take care.